damn. <laughs> a Motel 6. And that's <laughs> <laughs> Livid. <laughs> hey, y'all. Hello. <laughs> yeah, we're up in here. Okay, so I know. Doing? Okay, okay. So here's the thing. So now you got. I know you probably got a couple questions. And you're probably like, what the fuck is going on up in here, right? So yes, the podcast is coming back. I know this is like a premature look at it um, because. This will look different right here. Um, we'll probably, we'll have more camera angles. This is just the one camera angle because we're literally just testing everything out. But since we're testing everything out, I was like, well, let's mm -hmm. just have like a good, like a, a test shoot, would you rather? And, um, you know, well, this test shoot may go public. So um, here we are. And um, we look amazing. We do. Um, welcome we back do. to the Tight Ass Podcast. It feels good to say that. It does. I miss this. Mm -hmm. I really, truly do miss having the podcast. And um, this is where <laughs> we'll be. And we'll have artists come on. Um, we'll, they'll be sitting at this round table here with us. Um, I don't know if the round tables look like big on camera, mm -hmm. but it is like, I Jeez. wanted, I wanted like a, um, an intimate table. Mm -hmm. I didn't want like a huge, like I can't touch you table. Mm -hmm. Cause in case of a bitch have a breakdown moment, I need to be like, here's a tissue. Yeah. By the, by the way, I have a studio now. An entire studio. A whole, this is literally just a half of it. The other half will be YouTube and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. um, but we set up something over in this corner for the podcast. So yeah, yeah. And we have a lobby. We do. We have a lobby. We do up in you here. You can actually come through the lobby, and then you got to come to, through, through the back. Bitch, listen. Sickening. The girls are trying to upgrade around here. Yeah. Yes, you know. Is it a new moon coming up? I know you would know. It just passed, actually. Yeah, just passed uh, two days ago. Oh! Yeah. Okay, well, ago. and that's sickening, because mm -hmm. I just moved, I started moving the equipment in three days ago. Uh, uh, under the new moon, yes. Yes. So she'll be back. <laughs> yeah. All right. Well, <laughs> what we're going to do, I want to start off the show with a shot. Yes. How y'all doing up in here tonight? See, now, here's the thing about Trey Melvin, if you don't know. Um, you know, this bitch likes to get, quote unquote, hacked a lot, right? <laughs> but see, one thing this bitch cannot lie, deny, or try to be hacked about is being fucked up. See, the thing is, my brother here likes to, see, we're like yin and yang. I'm the house body. I will be in the house for days. Mm -hmm. This bitch will go to a bar. Mm -hmm. If you have the right liquor, the right ambiance, because she's not at every, she's not at every bar kind of bitch. No. Nope. It has to be the right ambiance, mm -hmm. the right drinks, and particularly the right people. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But if you have all those the ingredients right, oh, she's there. I'm there. I was just there last night. It, and now she's fucked up today. <laughs> Barely can breathe. Neck is broken. Broken. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. She can't. Really operate right now, but I'm but, here. But you know what? She's when I here. call, she comes. But she does. That's just that's what all that she matters. Okay, you hate tequila. I know. Do you want your wine? I do. Um, I don't know if I want a shot of it. Yeah, that sounds ratchet. It, it sounds yeah, like you, <laughs> like you trying to be you, classy. You ghetto. You it's real like, oh, you ghetto. You take a Every shot dad. of wine. Yeah. Ooh. And you know it might. And it's barefoot. And you know what? That's how you okay. know you're Five ninety nine. <laughs> Um, I took a shot of tequila last night too. And you should. I don't know why Ugh. I like tequila. Just... Where are my tequila drinkers out there tonight? As it's really quiet. You're right. <laughs> cricket, cricket. <laughs> Ugh. I love tequila. I think tequila is like literally the best drink. I do understand. You know why? Why? Because first of all, that potato shit you be drinking, <laughs> vodka. She I'm just, a vodka bitch. She weighs you down. Like I feel like vodka just like it could be tart. It can mm -hmm. be. It, it can be um, thick a little bit. You know, a, a tequila. I'm gonna be. I want to get up. I want to go. I want to run. I want to. <laughs> I want to. You know, I, feel and it's it's it's, it's liquidy. I you do know, get she, it. She's a smoother. Yeah, she's a smoother girl. Uh, oh, she's strong. I'm not so. I'm just not sure about. Well, you may be right. Yeah, I don't know. I'm just loyal. When I say vodka. I've just been drinking it since college, since freshman year. Well, Cle welcome clearly. to the dark side. Well. <laughs> yeah, we're going to have us a wonderful time tonight. We're going to open the show with a shot. Because here's the thing. We're talking about you today. We are. <laughs> yeah, y'all <laughs> yeah, motherfuckers sent us some, some freaky shit, okay? 
And now, if you don't follow me on Instagram, I put up a. This smells like. I'm gonna take a shot of this. That's so ghetto. I know. Please don't do that. I'm. I am hood. <laughs> <laughs> You're the like hood that, now, baby. Say that. <laughs> Try don't take yeah. that. I'm only because because I want to take a shot of that, but I've already been sipping a little bit of this. I don't know if y'all can see, and I'm going to be sipping it throughout the show. Okay, and I don't want to. I don't want to do that to me. <laughs> <laughs> what do you don't want to do to you, bitch? I don't want to do that to me. Do what to you? Pink Moscato and tequila. But wh- I don't want to put that in my body. Yeah, that's. <laughs> I'm already hungover. Ooh, I don't want to do that again. Okay. Okay. You know, I'll, I'll let it slide for now. You're really about to take a shot of this barefoot pink. Mus- you're really ghetto for drinking pink moscato. <laughs> I, let me tell you something. I'm, I'm not judging you, bitch. I know, bitch. Over there, bitch, you taking you, somebody. I'm yeah. saying this, girl. If you drink pink moscato at over the age of 25, I have to judge. I really do. I do. Pink moscato is because I'm a hood bitch from Detroit, so I can say this. Okay, <laughs> I can say this. I have the right. Bitch, Pink Moscato is hood. And it's for my bitches that really don't like wine for real, mm-hmm. but they try to be. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm cute. Mm-hmm. And you bitches will not clock me. Uh, and her bad. house is clean, too. It's very clean. Her house is clean. She takes her shoes off at the fucking door and she drinks Pink Moscato. Don't ask her about that other. Do- no, ping your, yeah. ping your, I don't know that shit. <laughs> What's that shit called? Ping it. Ping yang. Ping yang. I don't know that shit. Pin min your, min your, min. How do you say that other shit? How do you? I don't know. I don't know. Pino Grigio. There we go. Pino New York. No, what's the other one? I mean, New York. Noir. 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 Is it noir? Yeah, noir. How? Pino Noir. That's how you. How did you do that? Pinot Noir. My, there it is. I don't know. I love that for you. You're I, a <laughs> special kind of bitch. Hand me that lemonade down there. I'm scared. Yeah. Let's I'm scared. Each other in the eyes. I love you. I love you more. May this be a wonderful show. Ready? Yes, that'll be it. A wonderful series. Mm. Mm-hmm. I don't know why I'm saying it's good. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> Oh shit! Oh, you alright? Oh gosh, get a little shot. Yeah. All right. That's good. So today we're going to be talking. My, my eyes are watering. Oh. Today we're going to be talking. I don't drink. I'm a smoker, bitch. So this is a lot for me. Okay. <laughs> So today we're going to be, I asked you guys on Instagram, if you don't follow me on Instagram, mm. I asked you bitches to send me your craziest hookups or best hookup or um, a hookup that maybe have turned into a relationship, which is fine if it did, you know, that. because I wanted to talk about this app. Um, so <laughs> yeah, it's sponsored. Oh, you thought I was going to get up here and not have a sponsor for the first little go round of this podcast. Girl, please. You're wrong. We're going to have a wonderful time. And I love this sponsor because it gave me the opportunity to talk to you guys about you freaky bitches. What's that? Tammy, listen, I live uh, for Tammy because, listen, it's not just a dating app. It's more of an app to kind of connect with the LGBT plus Q community. I said plus Q. I'm not saying that's how it should go. That's just how I always said it. Anyway, (laughs) it gives the community a chance to actually just get to know people in your area that there's a lot of people that move and, you know, transplant and things like that. They, you know, it's kind of hard to find a sense of community when you're part of our community Mm -hmm. so i think this app gives you that opportunity to do so Mm -hmm. so so once you download tammy in the link description below it is a free app however you can do a paid subscription and a paid subscription can unlock some actual nice things you know you can actually do some things like change your location to meet new people all around the world you can see who viewed your profile and you can also use premium filters to find people that you're looking for in specific places of the world. That sounds creepy, but I guess if you're like <laughs> traveling, you're like, bitch, I want to find somebody up the street. I'm doing that. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I need you. As you can see right here, I'm setting up my own profile. It's really, really simple, really, really easy. It's just a couple of buttons, a couple of questions, a couple of things to answer. So you, people can get to know you really easily. It's not that hard. I mean, you go to the you go to, 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 to go to the app store, download the app, make your profile, upload a picture, put a nice little bio, a nice picture, you know, nice little something, something to make you look good. You want to show your best girl. And by the time you do all of that, now that I have a profile, I am going live. Yes, you heard me right. You want to go ahead and download that link right below because I'm going live Sunday, 
That is the 15th of August at 1 p.m. PST. So I want to see you there in that live stream because we get to finally talk and we're going to be talking about hookup culture, which we're talking about today. But I want to talk about hookup culture just in the sense of our community, how it sometimes can be a bad thing, but it could be a good thing. But I feel like it has been tainted to look like a bad thing due to the no fats, no fems, the people don't know their status. It's a whole lot, a whole lot of. And that live stream, I want to take time to sit down and talk about that. And I love and thank you so much to Tammy for giving me the opportunity to do this with you guys. So I'm really, really excited. I'll see you Sunday at 1 p.m. on the 15th of August. You better be there. We're taking this episode to talk about not even just hookup culture. Well, I guess, yeah, technically hookup culture, but like also relationships in general that are sexual. Because I think that we... I don't know if we just like kind of shun the or maybe got rid of the friends with benefits moment because I feel like we're calling oh, no I'm sorry it's called sneaky links now which I'm like <laughs> bitch you can call it a sneaky link but bitch I remember a time where it was just friends with benefits and you were mm-hmm. fucking on that person yes because that's what I wanted to do I and it was just that mm-hmm. they didn't go out into nothing else we didn't deal with any feelings I literally just want what I want and I'm ready to go mm-hmm so I won't be next. I, of course, I won't be saying anybody's names <laughs> up on here. But what I what I will do. <laughs> but I am. <laughs> I'm going to put it uh, right here on the screen. To you know, you know, you'll you'll know who you are when you read these stories. <laughs> So let's do okay, Trey. Should we? So let me see. I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna randomly mm-hmm. stop. Okay. Oh, okay. This is one. Be ready for this. What's what's it say? Me and my ex worked at a nursing home and we had sex in the library. <laughs> oh my god! At a nursing home? Would you fuck at a nursing home? Yes. <laughs> really? <laughs> It's not. I, I, I that just, sounds like death, and I don't know if I, <laughs> I can smell it. <laughs> I don't know, Trey. I can smell it. Trey, I don't know, man. I'm just. I'm. I'm disgusting. I mean, too, but bitch. So speaking of, okay, okay, okay. <laughs> mm-hmm. So Trey got hacked, right? <laughs> Trey didn't get hacked. What's how was What's the one? With the OnlyFans? OnlyFans.com slash Trey was not hacked. Trey was not hacked. He wasn't. So, <laughs> <laughs> so you would, okay, okay, would you make an OnlyFans video at a nursing home? <laughs> like, you know how some people make the OnlyFans videos on the stairwells of the hotels and uh-huh. shit? Which I stand. I do stand that. I don't know why I stand I do. that. But I live for you, bitch. <laughs> All the bitches have to get impounded in the stairwell. I live for you, girl. Because it takes a skill. It takes a skill. Bitch. Not pounding. Mm. Oh, it takes a skill because your legs—you got to be able to hunch up on some goddamn stairs, bitch. It does though. It does. Uh, uh. You, you got to <laughs> hold on to that rail, that fa- bitch. That face. No, for yeah, for real. I would do it. So <laughs> I would, and yes, I would. I would record <laughs> in the nursing home oh my. and put it on OnlyFans. Really? Yeah. All the girls would eat that up. I mean, they would. Yeah. I mean, you could. I like money. I don't know if y'all know. <laughs> <laughs> I like money from every which direction. Oh God! So I like money. <laughs> I do. I just love the cut of that. <laughs> <laughs> I like money. I don't know if you bitches know up in here. Oh, your pussy stinks. <laughs> I like money. I do. As you should. Yeah. As so you that should. means I'm gonna take my black ass. So how? Okay. So Sunny Acres. <laughs> <laughs> nursing home <laughs> in downtown Los Angeles. Bitch. Sunny Acres. That's that feels like the name. Yeah, it would. Have, that would be the name. Sunny fucking Acres, man. Sunny fucking Acres. Oh, would you? No, <laughs> absolutely not. I, not. I could not fuck in a, in a nursing home, bitch. And the bitch that did it, I live for you. Cause that takes a different types of balls. Cause like you can fuck in a mall, you know. You can fuck at a um, at a like you can, at a movie theater, mm-hmm. but a nursing home. It's not ideal. Somebody's having a heart attack down the street, <laughs> down yeah. the hallway, and you y'all both at the same time. Ah, it's all and about. They, ah, yeah. And they, <laughs> <laughs> it's about balance and duality to me. <laughs> Fuck out of here. No. Yeah. No. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I'm 
Okay, I'm taking another shot. Mm. Oh, this is the third shot. Who am I? I am oh, not no. this girl. I like that for you. You, I know you, this bitch loves anytime I'm fucked up. I do. Because you're not enough. <laughs> I'm never, <laughs> you're not enough. I'm high. Usually I'm, I'm high. I'm always high. I'm always high. But, I'm chilling. I'm, ch- I'm sitting down somewhere. I need you to. I, oh, need I would you have up. anxiety fucking a nurse. <laughs> <laughs> I think I, you know what but the thing is I would have anxiety having sex in public in general okay. I really just will be like somebody's watching me and I am getting down up in here I'm being a total 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 nasty bitch and I'm looking for it <laughs> but like somebody is watching me as a bitch who <laughs> really does oh yes an anxious bitch medication <laughs> all of it um, I'm not so sure that I will probably be, probably be anxious mm-hmm. but I would just be Ooh, just the thrill. Okay. The suspense of it all would just push me. I just see me in a, in a committed relationship mm-hmm. being nasty, and we're just fucking everywhere. Oh, as you should, though. I like that. That's now, what that's I see nursing now, home. Oh. <laughs> I'm in a committed relationship visiting my great-grandmother. Ooh! Yeah. Okay, now I, okay. And, you know, it's a it's a. It's okay, a now that you moment. put it that way, now, okay, so it's not a hookup. No. It's, well, some girls. <laughs> Is some, that what we thought? Some girls. <laughs> this entire time we've been talking about some girls. Hooking up, meeting at the nursing home. <laughs> Who are we visiting? That's why I said some people will fuck in the goddamn stairwell of the hotel. But, well, yeah, I would presume that they're staying at the hotel, though. You'll be surprised. So why would we be? <laughs> and I, we have nowhere else to go. Sneaky link. Me, so I'm just at the, me, by myself. Yeah, at, you're at the nursing home because. I'm visiting someone. You're visiting your grandma, right? And you mm-hmm. saw a fine ass boy walk past. Uh-huh. And you're like, oh, bitch, I and you know would what? bust him down. But the only time to do it. The only time to do it, this is a scenario here. Mm-hmm. The only time to do it mm-hmm. is if y'all meet up in the back and you're like, all right, let's go in the library over here. They don't, nobody come here just after hours. Just suck me up in the library. Oh, this is not getting monetized and I cannot wait. It's not. <laughs> you will never catch me doing it. Mm-hmm. Now, if a nigga came up to me and he was fine and he wanted, then, then yes. Mm-hmm. But niggas don't <laughs> usually do that. No, they don't. Niggas are usually intimidated by me. Yeah. Like, you don't usually approach me. I can see that for you. Yeah. I don't I'll like it. I'll be scared of you. Well, I would too. I'll be so scared I just, of you. <laughs> I'll be I like, I don't know about this bitch here. But, I, you know, I do. I don't it. know about this one. I'm, I'm scared of me Let's sometimes. Me do you another know? one. <laughs> okay. Uh, oh. I had sex with a guy in my garage while I was drunk. Normal. Okay. And I ended up puking all over him. Oh. Yikes. Mm. Yikes, <laughs> yikes, yikes. Yikes. Yikes, yikes, yikes. <laughs> that sounds disgusting. I'm so sorry. Mm. I know you embarrassed. You still embarrassed? Mm. I would well, be. Clearly not enough. I wouldn't be that embarrassed. Because let me tell you something. I'm already <laughs> fucked up. It was your discretion to know to put your dick in my mouth. It was your discretion. If you know that I was up here fucked up, you see me up here. You see me. Let me take my shot because they know what I'm talking about. If you see me up here, I'm already, I'm not living, right? But I do want to fuck. I do want to do something. But then you sit up here and you put your goddamn dick in my mouth. (laughs) And I'm, 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 I'm (laughs) fucked. In here. <laughs> oh, yeah. I'm bound to spit up. I'm bound, bitch. Girl, please. Mm. It, I mean, yeah, it is possible. Doesn't make it any less gross. No. But <laughs> no, no, no. No, uh-uh. But definitely possible, yeah. Mm-mm. I do get it. Mm-mm. I've been afraid. You know? Ooh. I've been there. Ooh. Well, not been there, but I've been afraid of being there. Oh, this is normal to me. A hot stranger at a sauna in a public gym. It was wild. Okay. I can see there, that. Yeah. I want to walk in on that so bad. Absolutely. Ooh, I want to do it. I, well, I don't know about that, but <laughs> I'm too scared for that. But yeah. let me tell you something. I'm not. I, <laughs> not me. <laughs> let that bitch speak for herself. Yeah. Listen, uh-huh. I actually want to like walk into a gym mm-hmm. and walk in on a gangbang. <laughs> like in a, in a sauna or something. And I'm, I'm, I'm talking about like just walking past, just yeah. trying to get home, just trying to go to the locker, get my shit, and like walk past and somebody is just like getting past. rammed. <laughs> in the boys' room. And I'm like, ooh, oh, oh. And I want to act uncomfortable first. I want to act like I'm not watching. Mm-hmm. I want to act like, no, you know, I'm, I'm, not, I'm not here. Ugh. I'm so above this. And then how? But like in the back of my mind, I'm like, ooh, 
Let me see that. Let me see. Let me watch. I'm going to take like 30 minutes to get my shit. (laughs) Not 30 minutes. Yeah. I'm just. I would as well. I would. In the locker like this. (laughs) Oh, oh, shit. Oh, that's calm. I walked. That's nuts. (laughs) I walked in on a, a, what was it? A threesome maybe? Uh, Not a, it wasn't a threesome. At the gym? An orgy. At the gym? In Hollywood, in the hills. At the gym? In Malibu. Oh. Not at at a house. Oh, I'm going to say like at a gym. Okay, well that's normal for us. Oh no, that's very normal. In LA, like you can, you go. (sighs) But it was still my first time. In LA, that's so normal though. You walk in on bitches getting popped. Yeah. (laughs) <laughs> you gonna walk? You gonna walk in on a bitch getting popped? Yeah, that's so true. Yeah, oh, girl, I'm gonna do that in the gym. So here's another one. I would do that at the gym too. I want to. I'm like, gonna go to the gym after at, this. You know, of course, when my you gonna go to the gym after this? <laughs> what? You gonna go to the gym after this? Huh? You gonna go to the gym after this? <laughs> I said. Uh huh. Yes. <laughs> I said yes. Yes. <laughs> All right. Oh. Oh, wait a minute. He was on A for A, which is Adam for Adam, if you don't know. Mm-hmm. I was 19. He was 37. <laughs> Midway through sex, randomly stops and asks, what is your name? <laughs> That's how it be, too. That's how it See, be. I've never had, like, a, a hookup through, like, an app because I was too scared for my to meet me. Mm-hmm. Like, I'm... <laughs> Why am I so scary? I don't but like, know. It's okay. But I, okay, okay. So here's the thing. Like, well, I'm not scared when it comes down to when it comes down. Mm-hmm. You know, like, bitch, if we're there, I'm there, and I'm there, and I'm here. And that's that. And I've arrived. Mm-hmm. mm-hmm. But like, as Hello? far as like, can you not hear you? I don't know why I feel like. Can you not hear you? I could be wrong. Could you not hear you? I can hear me. Oh, I hear you loud. I just feel, Ooh, you're okay. loud. Is that better? Yeah, I hear you. All right. Never oh, mind. Okay. okay. So <laughs> I never. <sighs> But I wanted this for my life, mm-hmm. right? I, I remember when I was younger, I wanted, like, when I was, like, in my early, early 20s, like, when I first hurt 20, mm-hmm. I wanted to be a whore. <laughs> and I really want people to understand that. Like, I really wanted, and I told, my, I told Brian this. I was like, I wanted to, like, be out there and, like, mm-hmm. be like, I had 30 bodies, bitch. <laughs> hat. You know, so I can know what kind of motherfucking Ugh. shit I like. But, like, I was, I fell into the trap of getting into a relationship Mm-hmm. And hope he's well. I hope. Oh boy, it's so good and well. <laughs> love that. I mean, he's actually really good. He has another relationship. He's good. He's sickening. Okay. Um. Go, go. But I was. In a, I fell in love and mm-hmm. got into a relationship. And you know, I didn't have the chance to really like whore out in my mm-hmm. early twenties because by twenty one, I was in a relationship for like three years to so like my twenty third birthday. Mm-hmm. And so. And then from 23 to 24 to 25, I was out here in L.A. And I didn't like really whore out in L.A. because L.A. scares me because mm-hmm. I don't know what the fuck. Um, and mm-hmm. I mean, I had a couple of, run, you know, rendezvous, you know, mm-hmm. uh, you know, I had mm-hmm. a couple of rendezvous, but I didn't have like that moment to yeah. like six months straight club, another club. Bus, mm-hmm. plane, another Bus. club, another club. Like, I didn't have, I didn't have Bus. you know what I'm saying? I didn't have that time. Uh-huh. So, like, I kind of lived that bitch just be like, yeah, I was on, you know. <laughs> I would actually be very upset if I invited a bitch to my house and you mm-hmm. are on top of me or I'm on top of you and you have the nerve to be like, what's your name again? In the midst of the, in the, in the, midst of the stroke, bitch. I'd be like, oh my God. Yeah, I wouldn't have done that. I'm like, girl, you gotta get the, the fuck out of my goddamn house. Yeah. You got to leave. I've definitely done it after. Ooh. Yeah, like texted. Oh, okay. What well, is texted is one thing. Yeah. But I thought, she, like, in your face, like. Oh, yeah, that's probably happened too. I don't know. Like, bitch, what's your name again? <laughs> Meanwhile, but I've like, come you know, all in your face. <laughs> not my kids are all over you. They're everywhere. However, what is your name again? What's your name again? Ooh, <laughs> bitch, when I say I'll be pissed. I'll be one piss thought like that a, day. <laughs> it's, you know, but it's not like that, though. It's not a shady what is your name, you know? It's, it's like there's a mutual understanding. It's a mutual understanding of we like, don't know each other's oh names. my God, that was such a good time. Yeah. Thank you for ramming me. Your name? <laughs> <laughs> like, is yeah. it that? Is it that? that. Thank you yes. for fucking me up. What's yeah. your name again, babe? <laughs> Honey, what's your name? <laughs> I need I, you know what I need a bitch to have a cigarette and a robe Ooh, that was yeah. wonderful <laughs> the door is over there but before you go what's your name again I'm talking about robe the wig yeah. is off yeah the, uh, delightful yeah. woman very oh, thank you so much really enjoyed that yeah but I just need to know what is your name <laughs> damn I yeah. was like bitch yeah 
Oh. I've been there. (laughs) (laughs) Oh, shut up. What? Oh, my God. Best hookup was after an Uber pool went home with a Spanish and a Swedish guy, and it was a threesome. They end up having a threesome. Bitch, in an Uber pool. Okay. Oh, I live for this. I like that. Because I low-key always wanted to know. (laughs) If a bitch was in an Uber pool, right? I've never took an Uber pool a day in my life, but if I did, right? If I did. Mm Mm-hmm. I've always wanted to know. I'm in the Uber pool, right? And the mm-hmm. motherfucker, I'm in the middle of the seat, you know? Mm-hmm. And I, I got all this ass back here, so it's, you can, you can feel a little bit of it. Mm-hmm. I'm in the back seat. I'm in the middle of, I'm in the middle of both of these two men uh-huh. in my mind. Mm-hmm. And I've always wondered, like, okay, if the guy on the left and the guy on the right is fine as shit, mm-hmm. and you're the first stop, mm-hmm. and y'all been, like, kind of rubbing, maybe knees rubbing, mm-hmm. you know? Or maybe having, like, a funny conversation about whatever the fuck happened that night. Mm-hmm. Like, bitch... I've always wondered, like, bitch, I wonder if a motherfucker was like, you want to come upstairs? Yeah. Like, I think that, I don't know why I feel like that's like. You said you've always wondered that? Like, do a bitch like. Like, if that happens? Yeah, like, do you want to come upstairs? (laughs) Like, in an Uber pool. I guess it does. I guess it does, clearly. (laughs) But, like, would you do that? Like, if you was in an Uber pool and it was like, you saw two, like, fine guys. Would you make it a threesome at that, number one? Now it's a threesome. He didn't say one person. He made it a threesome. I would want to do it. I wouldn't. I wouldn't actually do it. I'd be too anxious in that moment. Me too? See, then, okay. Yeah. So you have to, yeah. Yeah. Unless it's like the driver. <laughs> I wouldn't want the driver knowing my business. Mm-hmm. That's the thing. I love, I live for all of this shit, but I'm very Scorpio. I'm very PR. Mm-hmm. So I'm very, <laughs> very mindful of who hears what and when they hear it. So I wouldn't. Shut unless up. Unless it's the driver. If, uh, if we're why, all in on okay, it, then why okay. the driver? Because they have a profile on Uber. You can find them. Because <laughs> we're all in on it. Okay. It's not like the driver over here and what, me being a. <laughs> <laughs> it's slut. Yeah. In the backseat. Yeah. Yeah. Ooh, I would want to, though. Not, not he drop off one person and all three get out in the back. Yikes. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I, where y'all going? I got somewhere else. I got does that mean I get the rest of my coin? <laughs> does the Uber driver get the rest of his coin? His or her coin? If it, like if y'all so. stop, does it, like what happens after that? I like, think the trip is over. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck! I'm pissed. Bitch, you gotta get your nut busted, and I gotta uh, my bills ain't paid now. Bitch, I had two other motherfucking rock, and, and this bitch took them. I'm, bitch, I'm following a complaint. I will file a complaint, bitch. Quickly. Well, so after you bust your nut, bitch, and you get up from your goddamn bed, you'll see. <laughs> this lawsuit. This, yeah. Girl, please. Girl, please. I was supposed to drop you off oh, 20 miles no. from here. Uber, here go another one. Uber mm-hmm. to a Motel 6 okay. at mid- <laughs> Period. I love y'all for this. <laughs> Uber to a Motel 6 at midnight like a hooker just for three minutes of four inches. Oh. Yikes. Damn. <laughs> a Motel 6. And that's tight. <laughs> <laughs> that would be <laughs> livid. <laughs> I'm about to spit out. I'm about to spit out. <laughs> oh my god, I'm hot. Um, <laughs> I, brought, I brought fans. I'm hot because I, I need it. Ooh, thank you. Oh god, where's she at? Oh, <laughs> oh god. No, All right. Listen. Mm-hmm. Imagine. Uh, who's this? Oh, that feels good. That do. Fuck. Imagine. Oh, they're going on sale soon. Imagine. <laughs> <laughs> Imagine, first of all, mm-hmm. first of all, a bitch sends you an address <laughs> to motherfucking motel. Because, bitch, if I, if I got an address drop and you was like, okay, here's my location, mm-hmm. and I pull it up and it says motel, I'm like, something's wrong. I think something's <laughs> off. I think you maybe sent me the wrong address. No. no it's you, it's, this is where I be. I would be so fucking pissed. Mm hmm. You Uber. Would you still go? Would I? Would you still go if somebody was like, I'm at a Motel 6? Oh, yeah. If it's the right, you know, <laughs> if the nigga fine. No! 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 You may try to harvest my organs. <laughs> they could do that in their home. True that. As well. That's true. But that's why I don't go they to people's do houses. I don't go to people's houses. So where do you go? You have to come to me. <laughs> 
so I can know where, it's only one way in, one way out, and I know where all my weapons are hitting at. <laughs> yeah. You gotta come to me, baby. I get that though. No, I'm, mm, I get I'm not going to your house. I'm not I, coming because then, then I'm in your territory. Then if I try to run, you know how to kill me. <laughs> <laughs> I need to know how to get out of here. <laughs> the way I see it, I can't. Right? I just can't trust nobody's house. And then if your house smells like corn chips, I'm gonna be pissed. pissed. And then people beds don't be. <laughs> mm, your bed stinks. <laughs> I've had a really, I've had a lot of really good experiences in people's homes. Yeah. You know, I'm still haven't been killed yet. <gasps> so that's good, right? Oh, I lived for this one. What happened? I was tricked. <laughs> okay. yeah, I love that. Shit. I was tricked into sleeping with my boyfriend's twin brother. Tricked. And not you falling down. Trey, how did your trick go down, bitch? Just the lever. <laughs> the lever, my foot went up. <laughs> I'm screaming at the timing. <laughs> I was tricked into sleeping with my boyfriend's twin brother. Uh-huh. They had kinks and did a fucking parent trap. Oh, no. You wouldn't do that? I would. I would do that. I would actually. I would low-key do that. I would actually low-key ask both of y'all to. Ain't that right? No. <laughs> I did not consent to having sex with your twin yeah, brother. I mean, well. That's right. <laughs> It's <laughs> not funny, first of all. No, but I'm laughing at the scenario, not not <laughs> the actual all. act. But that's damn. That's assault. Is it really? Yeah. I mean, I feel like because, like, if you had a boyfriend, right? Uh huh. And that bo- your 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 boyfriend had a twin brother. Uh huh. You wouldn't be mad. Oh no, I wouldn't be mad. I'd do it. I'll do it. But oh wait, cause... but I do it with. But then, and then, no, but, but if your boyfriend came, oh, because if your boyfriend came out like, oh, hi, that's my brother. Yeah. Meanwhile, you got oh, cum towel all over. <laughs> Fighting. Like, you like, like, oh, imagine you in the bed. <laughs> leaking. Leaking from all the aftermath. Oh, that was Fighting. good. That was amazing. And then your boyfriend comes out the door. Was that good? The fuck going on around here? We're fighting. But they had a kink. I don't know whose business that is. That's not mine. That's not yours? That's not my business. I would do it knowingly. Knowingly. Like, let me fuck your twin brother. Yeah, absolutely. (laughs) Fuck yeah. Let me see if he had the same dick as you. Okay. That's all I want to know. That's all I want to know. Listen, let me fill this up in here. Okay. I ended up leaving him for the twin. (laughs) Imagine. (laughs) (laughs) Oh, shit. Imagine. Oh, imagine. You leave him for the fucking twin. That's my brother. Jokes on you. Jokes on you, bitch. I want him. <laughs> I want him now. <laughs> well, fuck you. <laughs> I would be like, oh my God. Fuck you. Jokes on you. We're yeah, engaged. jokes on you, bitch. I'm fucking with him. <laughs> We're engaged. Girl, I was with this guy, and he done offered me up to his friends uh-huh. who came to visit without asking me. So they offered your pussy up to his. He was she was with a guy. Okay. And apparently they was having friends visiting the house. Okay. And he offered her pussy to said guy friends. That and it just ends there. It ends there. No context. Also, no. <laughs> the side of why would you order? Why would you order? Why would you send my pussy up like it's a fucking yeah? That bitch gonna be down. Yeah, that's not even yeah. Fighting. Mm-mm. I'm calling the police. Actually, Got this it. guy tried to pull out Vaseline as lube for my pussy. <laughs> Because I was too tight. Dot dot dot. Vaseline, like petroleum jelly, bitch. <laughs> oh no. Fuck. Oh up. no. Yeah, no. No, ma'am. Oh, no. I haven't no. used Vaseline in a long time. Huh? I ain't used Vaseline in a if long you, time. If you, girl, because first of all, let me tell you something. If you over the age of eighteen and you're still using Vaseline, we have to talk. There's a problem. We have to talk because let me tell you something. <laughs> Or spit. I don't like bitches that be. And let me just. Really? No. I wouldn't prefer it, but <laughs> done it. Ew. Yeah. Cause like no, bitches hurt. Job done. No, I mean it Nothing does hurts. It can get the job done. It gets the job. It can, with the right you, amount. You have to be open already a little bit though. Yeah, definitely. You cannot be. Oh, I haven't no, had no, sex for like two and, weeks. Yo, no fuck. Well, two then, weeks or two years. Two oh, weeks is like two, that. No, 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 no. Okay. Two weeks, your hole should be tightened back up. <laughs> I would hope so. In two weeks, if you haven't done no activity, nothing up that canal. <laughs> <laughs> Who are we 
we, we talk about bitches that have sex regularly or I'm talking about regularly. Okay. And if you if like two weeks and your pussy is still wide open, we need to talk. I just because <laughs> I feel like at least in my personal experience, honey, after about a day, mm-hmm. after about two or three days of not like after if you got popped and then about two days pass, you tight again. If mm-hmm. you're not like virgin tight again, but you're not put some spit on me and slide up in me tight again, bitch. You okay? You're right. You know what I'm saying? You're right. Like, bitch. You're right. What's yours? My nastiest hookup or yeah. worst hookup? Let me see. That's yeah. a good question. Um, okay, we can end it with me. Um, <laughs> mm-hmm. Or me. Yeah, well, yeah. <laughs> mm-hmm. What was my worst? I'm going to say like my worst. So I'll give my best. My worst hookup. <laughs> oh, my worst hookup. 2018. I'll never forget it. Mm-hmm. Oh, my God. <laughs> Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. Mm-hmm. So I was living with the best friend at that time. Mm-hmm. And well. yeah, yeah, yeah. And <laughs> I moved, I brought the guy upstairs mm-hmm. and we met, we went on a date actually. Okay, nice. Went on a date that night. Okay. And I was like, yeah, just come upstairs, you know? Mm-hmm. Oh my God. Mm-hmm. <sighs> Came upstairs, we kissed. And we it got passionate. We got good. We got good. It got good. You know, I was about to, I was about to get my life. Mm-hmm. I was about to poke him down. Okay. But then he took his shoes off. Oh. And then I said, "Oh, it smells like feet in here. <laughs> it smells like feet." And I might, might mind you, beautiful looking man, mm-hmm. gorgeous. Like I was like, "Oh my god!" Like he would never stink. I, that was like that'd be like the like the last thing on my mind. Mm-hmm. I was like, "That'd be like the last complaint" because he looked so presentable. Hmm. But I guess looks can be deceiving. <laughs> and he took his shoes off. Mm-hmm. And you know when you take your mm-hmm. shoes off and you get that first. Uh-huh. And I said, <laughs> I said, my room smells like feet all of a sudden. And I know it ain't mean. But I continue and I digress because I was like, okay, I'm horny. I'm already here. I'm mm-hmm. horny. Mm-hmm. And so mm-hmm. as we go along, mm-hmm. and this is why no shade to nobody, but I'm, I'm scarred from uncut. I peel back the uncutness of it all and it smells like cheese. So now I'm like, I, I was in a dilemma here. I said, okay, I could, I could say, you need, we need to stop. But he was kissing my neck and I was like, I don't want to stop. You know, I don't want to be like, oh my God, you should, you know, this is not it. You smell like cheese and feet. <laughs> Oh, I'm sorry if you're watching this. I live for you now. I, I do. I don't know you anymore, but I hope you're doing well. A peace and light. Um, <laughs> <laughs> you smell like cheese, and you smell like feet, and you smell like Frito Lay, and you got in my face <laughs> because I wasn't going down on you. You smell like cheese, so I said, you know, you oh, can. This is disgusting. He said. But you know, he wanted me to fuck him. But I was like, mm-hmm. he was like, but I don't suck dick. And I said, oh, this is just, this is, un- this is unfortunate. That like, sounds horrible. So I politely put my clothes on. <laughs> I did. I put my clothes on and I politely put on, um, the, at the time, video game Spider-Man. Mm-hmm. And I said, we want to help me finish playing this game. I made it uncomfortable <laughs> for him. Like, do you want to leave? Like, cause I don't, I never kicked anybody out before. So I was like, do I like kick him out? Like, so I was like, let me just make this now uncomfortable. So he'd be like, I should just leave, you know? Mm -hmm. So I was like, you want to help me come finish this game? He was like, sure. I was like, fuck. You know, know, (laughs) I thought maybe he'll be like, fuck no, I'm leaving. He was like, sure, I'll play. Feet still out. So you still have your shoes off, okay? Here we are. Him his, his pair of socks or something. So we're playing. <laughs> no, it was feet stink. <laughs> you put in a bar of soap. We, <laughs> we started playing a game, and I just remember <laughs> that best friend walking in was like, like you know, just to see if I was okay. Mm-hmm. I was like, what stinks in here? <laughs> But he didn't, he didn't have any, he didn't think, you know, he was just kind of just like naturally said it. <laughs> <laughs> and I was like, yeah, you know. <laughs> so there's a little funky in here, isn't it? Mm. And he was like, are y'all talking about me? And I was like, oh. <laughs> Shoes, maybe. <laughs> I, said maybe I said maybe we should put your 
put your shoes on. You know, I remember I had that balcony in that room. I don't know if you remember. I said, maybe you should put your shoes on the balcony. He was livid, bitch. I would have been as He well. said, I'm going to leave. I said, okay. <laughs> That's okay. I said, okay. <laughs> Not, no. I said, okay. <laughs> no, like because I know there's like good uncut penis out there. Right. Like I, I feel under- like that's a stigma and that they're trying to fight every day. Stigma. <laughs> trying to fight it. Which is why I was pissed. Because <laughs> I was like, when he pulled it down, I was like, oh, I got this, bitch. I got this. I'm about to pull the skin back and get to work. <laughs> <laughs> And so you imagine how pissed I was. I was like, "Oh no!" That sounds, you know, yeah. yeah. Could be me. So that was me. What was yours? Worst. I'm trying to think because I've had a couple. Oh, what was the worst? I don't know if I can or remember. Cringiest. I've just had so much sex. Mm-hmm. I don't. <laughs> mm-hmm. 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 I don't know. <laughs> I've just had so much cock. Yeah. 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 So much cock. So much hole. Yeah, just holes in general. Just pussy. Yeah. I'd be forgetting that. That was a, a time. time. His um, real name is not Jordan. His real name is not Jordan. Yeah. Uh, but we're going to call him Jordan. We're going to call him Jordan for now. <laughs> <laughs> we had sex in the city hall. Right in one of the boardrooms. <laughs> on the table. Long table. Imagine! It was a We're going to pass this bill. Does it smell like booty? It <laughs> doesn't smell like butt. <laughs> See you. I smell like... <laughs> I just want to smell like it's a ball. <laughs> <laughs> so you, so you imagine, that. <gasps> yeah. Imagine trying to pass a bill of legislation or some <laughs> shit. Like, okay, I'm gonna sign it. Just, just, just randomly. Does it not smell like a butt cheek in here <laughs> on the table? I'm just every time I pass a, a, a paper down, I smell butt. Did you not smell that? I just want. I hope it's a black lady that said it too Ooh. in the middle of a meeting. But I do all due respect, sir. Does it not smell like ass in here? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I should make that into a story. That time. is hilarious. I have an Adam and Eve sponsorship this month. And too. you should do that. I'm gonna tell it. Because that's hilarious. Yep. That is hilarious. Bitch, on a ma- just I just and you need to make that scenario. Somebody doing like leg- like a whole board is meeting. I'm gonna do that. Or like the Congress people is meeting and they like and they're gonna pass the bill, pass the bill. And one bitch like, before I sign this. I smell ball. <laughs> and it's just, I'm getting a whiff of ass in here. But you don't smell that? Can we run back the tapes? <laughs> yeah, just, from last night. Because it smells like somebody fucked right here. Yeah, I smell it. Like right in my seat. Like, oh my God. That is Ooh. hilarious. That needs to happen on tape. That is hilarious. That absolutely. is something you should film. I'm going to do that. Thank that you. is absolutely hilarious. I'm going to do that. Oh, God. great sex though! Yeah. Great sex, great table. Yeah, uh, well, n- not comfortable. Yeah, but that's not what matters. Yeah, but I mean, what matters um, is you get what you need out of it. We did get what we needed. Yeah, a great conversation. His truck afterwards. I love that though. Yeah. I love having sex in a good convo, in a good and I didn't get that until my boyfriend now. I'm sorry. Yeah, I didn't get that. Mm-hmm. Yeah, because you know, but, but but you know how I talk. Mm-hmm. You know my subject matter is, uh-huh. is deep, mm-hmm. and motherfuckers can't get that deep. They don't want to. They don't want. And they'd be like, "Ooh, I, I, I thought we were nutting. We were just nutting." <laughs> and you are wow. talking about the world. That's also uh, me, though. Mm, yeah, mm, also me. Yeah, hate it. Like you don't like deep conversation. I know. I don't like that. I do that. <laughs> oh, like what? I wish I could just fuck. Oh, but then you want to talk, and then I want to talk about yeah, the world. Yeah, I want to have. I want to because now I need to pick your brain. Yeah, you know. I hate that because people <laughs> don't care. Don't give a fuck. Yeah, yeah. They could be like, "Bitch, get the fuck out." Okay, I'm done now. <laughs> no, I want to talk about the world now. Please. Yeah. What are What are your dreams? What are your goals? I'm going to, I'm calling my Uber. (laughs) Damn. Imagine. What are your goals? My Uber's 10 minutes away. This was fun. (laughs) So I want to take one more shot to let us go. While I'm taking this shot, please take the time to look in the description below to download Tammy because I will be there 1 p.m. Sunday, August 15th. Mm -hmm. So you should be there with me to have that convo about hookup culture. (laughs) I want to have a convo about hookup culture, Mm -hmm. the stigmas about around hookup culture, um, why it's viewed as like 
a whore or a slut thing, which I don't think it should be viewed that way. Mm-hmm. Um, I think it should be. I think casual sex is healthy in my mind. I don't know. Maybe I don't know what I'm talking about. But in my mind, <laughs> casual sex is healthy as long as it's safe, as that. long as it's not um, uh, discriminatory. Um, I think it's safe and I think I it's concur. fun. And I think that it should be embraced and not looked down upon. We'll talk about it more on the on the live stream. But until then. Cups up if you're at home. <laughs> if you have a blunt, put it up. Put your goddamn cup down. It's okay. empty. I love you guys so fucking much. Thank you for tuning in to this trial podcast episode. But when the podcast does air, this is what it will be pretty much. Um, a little bit more decorative, obviously. More celebrity. It'll be celebrity guests. And it'll be me and Trey talking to them and getting drunk and talking shit. Mm-hmm. Pretty much. That's what it is. That's the show. I love you guys watching as always and listening now. Because that's going to be the thing. Mm-hmm. And we will catch you guys in the next episode. I love you. <laughs> Ooh. Yuck. It's like a marker. Ugh. I love you guys. I said that already. I said, I said, I think I said that. I'm just hot and drunk. I love you. Bye. Bye. <laughs> Bye. <laughs>